Yeah. Hey, uh, you were uh, you busy? Uh, sort of. Shame that. Why? Well, I, I swear you're meant to be uh, reviewing that swanky LG monitor instead of faffing on your computer. Hey, I'm not faffing. Am I wrong? Yes. When did they uh, want that back, by the way? At uh, 17th of July. Today? I suppose so. I'll just, um, I'll leave this uh, here, shall I? Just in case you forget. I won't forget. Better uh, get that video done. Okay, now can I? Okay, sure, yeah, I'll, I'll go. Oh, by the way, happy birthday. Right, I am going blind for this one. Who needs glasses? Not me. <laughs> so the video didn't even say it. Today, I am 24. That is the date of birth of which I was born, which is today. And as always, there's always excitement to come on. I mean, this is like the second vlog in a week that I've uploaded. It's madness. I'm gonna start off the insomnia story. Despite the fact I'm sleep deprived, I went to Insomnia at the gaming event and I met LG or a couple of people from LG. They were wonderful people to meet and told me about all the gossip that's happening in the world, like OLED stuff, which is organic light emitting diodes, which I won't lie, had to Google. And it's weird because these, these organic things are grown in greenhouses. I mean, who knew? Anyway, three months after the event, I got in contact with LG and they sent me a review screen to review. And I thought, instead of doing a, a bog standard review and telling you about, I don't know, the, the fact that it's 27 inches full HD 1080p and a 240 hertz refresh rate, free sync AMD technology, or the fact that you can swivel it around and raise it up and down. No, I'm giving you a gamer's review because that's what I do. I'm a gamer, so I'm gonna tell you how it plays after using it for the past two weeks. Better way than telling you how it works on my birthday. And then sending it back as soon as I've done this video in this box. So I'm packing this up when we're done. Yep. Goodbye, gamer monitor. Normally you get given things on your birthday, you don't have to send them back. Unless it's clothes and they're too small. So I haven't just been using this monitor for gaming. I've been editing short films on there, I've been editing the, the vlogs on there. And I've also been watching movies on there. And I want to clarify that the whole thing is bloody vibrant and sharp and crisp. It's better than my Sony TV and that's saying something. So Ubisoft gave me the Crew 2 the other day. So I thought, you know what? I'm going to plug it in through the display port on my graphics card, my GTX 970. Put on all the ultra settings and, and just see how it looks. Bloody impressive. And yeah. And if that wasn't it, I thought, you know what I'll do? I'll, I'll play some Call of Duty. And there's some gorgeous settings on the screen, which means you can put like a crosshair mark on, which shows you the, the, the pinpoint middle of the screen. Which means shooting from your hip is so much easier. And plus, because of the refresh rate, everything is so bloody perfect. I won a lot of matches. But to top that off, I then put it into Halo, and I thought, hey, I haven't played Halo in a long time, I wonder if I'm still as good as I used to be ten years ago. Answer to that one is, is no, I'm, I'm not, but put me on SWAT, I was incredible, I was on fire, I was getting all those overkills, and wasn't recording them, which is the stupid thing, ugh, what am I like? So not only that, with the AMD FreeSync technology, guys, it, it, it stops the stutter. It makes everything so much smoother, which, which I didn't get. Like, I I had no idea that this is what monitors do these days. Uh, so that was incredible. But also, when I was in Insomnia, this is what the guys there told me. I spoke to some lovely, lovely gentlemen, some lovely women, and uh, they, they said, Lewis, let's get you on Fortnite. Let, let play some Fortnite and you can see for yourself. And not only was I dreadful at Fortnite at Insomnia, but the, the monitor was was incredible. And it just it shows me that I put these monitors next to each other. But my old Asus monitor, I'm looking at the monitors, they're over here, by the way. Just just in case you're wondering where I'm looking. Like comparing it to my Asus monitor, like putting them next to each other and doing a split screen thing, it, it, it it's crazy. It's madness. I mean obviously if you want to know the details and the specs guys, I'll put them all in the description, but 
for today and for what it's worth, it was a bloody beautiful monitor to use and have the privilege to use it for the past two weeks for a, for a review thing and it's not often that I get a review thing so that was that was pretty darn cool. And so my last farewell gift for, for you and for me is is to edit this video on the monitor before we say farewell to this LG. 27 inch Full HD. Hang on, I've got the name here. 27GK750F screen. I think that O was meant to be a zero. You know what? That was that was a beautiful two week birthday present that I got to test out a screen for. It's not often that you get to try something before you buy it, so hopefully an investment shall be made. Guys, if you want to check out the monitor, take a look at the link in the description, say hello to the LG guys for me, and I will be back soon for some more gaming videos, hopefully. And uh, I'm gonna go enjoy my birthday, put on my glasses, because you know what? I'm going home. Unlike it, actually, just like England, who have come, have come home. They didn't bring it back, though. I'm gonna go, I don't do football speak. I'll see you later. Dad, uh, bye.